Economic fallout from the COVID-19 pandemic, a food crisis worsened by war in Ukraine, and climate change are among the challenges facing many African countries expected to define the two-day conference. The conference comes as Russia and China have sought to increase their economic and other influence in Africa. The Japanese government created and hosted the first DICAD summit in 1993. The conferences now are co-organized with the United Nations, the African Union, and the World Bank. This year, discussion around an increase of Japanese investments in Africa is anticipated with particular focus on supporting startups and food security initiatives. Japan has said it plans to provide assistance for the production of rice alongside a promised 130 million US dollars in food aid. <laughs> え、同時にアフリカへの投資促進のため引き続きビジネス環境の改善にも取り組みます。Africa Center for Strategic Studies and Academic Institution of the U.S. Defense Department compared the conference's format to the annual World Economic Forum in Davos, Switzerland. However, this weekend summit has sparked controversy in Tunis, which faces its own acute economic crisis, including a recent spike in food and gas line shortages. <laughs> 